Let's look into the film. In this video, we will be looking at Kelvin Joseph as well as Trayvon Diggs. Now, this play, I know for sure Kelvin Joseph wish he was able to get it back. Pressure right there in the face of the quarterback, as you can see. Oh, he owed me some push-ups, man. Let's say 24 push-ups for missing this one. But if you go all the way back into everything, you will see that inside the slot, that is Anthony Brown. And, of course, Kelvin Joseph. Now, you have different type of cornerbacks. You have a press cornerback. You have a cornerback that's played well in space as a zone cover cornerback. Kelvin Joseph got a unique blend of skill that he's pretty much both. He can press. He can redirect. He's physical. And he's a good He's good. He's pretty good in zone as well. So they got zone responsibility. And I want you guys to pay attention to this look right here. This is a concept that the Cowboys like to disguise. You have one single pretty much high safety, which is going to convert into pretty much a quarters, uh, meaning that he know that he have uh, above help and he's going to play to his zone. And as well as Anthony, he's going to play to his zone coverage right here. And you see these, these guys are pretty much in a zone concept, knowing that they got to help over the top. So they're not going to get out of their position. They're reading the eyes of the quarterback, and they have to feel. He got to go by feel of the safety over the top. And that plays a major role as far as continuity and consistency of knowing your safety help over the top, believe it or not. So you got to get in rhythm with that, believe it or not, as well. And he drops his ball. Oh, he owed me 24 push-ups. 24 push-ups, Kelvin. You know, maybe we're going to have to do him just like we did with uh, Demarcus Lawrence. We ain't going to call him balls man nor fat until he make a play. All right, good block right there. Good block by Corey to get inside and watch uh, my guy Ghost and pick this up for six points. I love it. Phase of the game, special teams. All right, so let's look at Trayvon Diggs. Back pedal is really smooth. Stride for stride with the receiver. And he played this just like he's the receiver on this one. <laughs> hey, he keep his eyes on the quarterback as well as he filled the receiver. And he's picking up key indications of where this quarterback is trying to go. Sweeze, phase in, high point that ball. And man, oh my goodness. He ain't scary Terry no more. Hey, Trayvon Diggs is your father. Yeah, yeah. Your mama already requested child support back pay. And watch how he picked his ball out of the sky. Yeah. Roll tie with it. Walk off smoothly. And he said, man, I can't believe they disrespected me. All right. So let's look at this play. Uh, I know a lot of people want to talk about this one, right? Now, big play by Brown. Oh, my God. Trayvon Diggs. Let's look at this route concept. Now, he's playing off, of course, and this is a third down play, I believe. And when you look at everything, you'll see coverage pretty good by everybody. I just wish that my safety, he get a little bit deeper than this one. And he plays it too shallow because he's too underneath, but that's okay. Not deep enough. That's okay. He's reading the quarterback eyes, and he's going by vibe. Uh, everybody's covered pretty well. Even LVE is over the top of this one. The first down marker is right here. And KZ pretty much stopped his feet a little bit. And, no, he kept his feet moving. Good transition to his hip. Just in recovery phase from here. So he recovery phase right as the quarterback begins to load. He got a race to this point. So he should be the underneath guy. And my guy Diggs, he did his job perfectly. He covered anything on the boundary side. He took away the seven. He took away any uh, hitch route. He took away any fly route. And all he had was this one right here, in, inside deep. And he had he's supposed to have inside help. And the ball right on the money. That's right on the money. There's nothing Trayvon Diggs can do. The only thing Trayvon Diggs can do on this uh, concept is – Climb up, redirect, knock him off his route. That's the only thing that I can say that he could have done on this. Watch how he flip his hips. Whew. Man, that's good, baby. Yeah, he's over the top. He's right in good position. I just wish my safety, if my safety was deeper, if my safety was deeper and he turned around right there, that could have been an INT. But shout out to Heineke putting that ball right on the money. I can't complain about that. That's a good throw by Heineke. And good catch by number two. 
Mr. Brown over there. And as you look at everything, you see that he had no pressure on this. We didn't really have any of our guys in as relates to our dominant pass rushers. If you look back at that, let's look at it one more time. This is film study right here, Cowboy Nation. So look at it. You have 97, 98, 93, 92. No one get, no one get close to the quarterback. And when you have time to throw, of course, somebody will be open. And that's just a good throw by Heineke. Real good throw. All right, so we look at this play. Watch how Joseph break down. He shoots through his guy. Told you guys he's very aggressive, right? So you look at this play. Shout out to Brown for taking on the blocker right there. That's a big boy. And Brown faced him up straight up. Bam! He get there and 24 get there. I like the way 24, he saw that the man was getting low. And think about this. Number 24 is, of course, Kelvin Joseph. Watch how he dropped that shoulder on him. You try to get low. I can meet you before you get there and get him out of bounds. I love it, Cowboy Nation. Uh, his ability to play the run is pretty good. And I like that. He's not a guy that whiffs on his tackles. He's a hard tackler, by the way. And I like what I see out of Kevin Joseph on that play. All right, so this is another play that you have to pay attention to. My guy, Kevin Joseph. Bam! He reading the actual offense there, playing his keys pretty right. And you see Wilson come down the field as well. And watch. Snap the ball. He get off of his guy. And he come down to get that play. Come off of his guy, get down there and make that play. I like seeing this. And Wilson come in to finish. And he gives you a little a little action after the hit. I like seeing that out of Kelvin Joseph. Bam. Yeah. Aggressive guy, Cowboy Nation. And he will let you know as well. <laughs> he will flat out too. Uh, being able to read this and blowing up this play, uh, negative two yards. He forced that on this pass right here. That's a good way to sniff out this thing. Like I said, when I looked at this Kentucky tape, I saw a willing tackler. I saw a guy aggressive. I see that out of him. Uh, he pays attention. He sees where the quarterback is going with the ball and explode on it. He's quick. He got there almost before the receiver was able to turn. And that could have been dangerous for this receiver. And shout out to Kelvin Joseph. Boss man fat at this point. And this is another play. Come back toward the ball sideline and get there as far as that recovery. Knock that ball up out of there. And he gives you the Dikembe McWave. You know, uh, he's not McTumbo, but he is Kevin Joseph. I like seeing this out of the young DB. I've seen a lot of potentials out of him. I, I know that this is his, what, first game starting. And pretty much the majority of his reps, he played solid. Didn't allow many of yards, uh, negative two. Uh, yards off of one so uh, I, I'm looking at this guy and I'm seeing everything Anthony Brown playing inside the slot while he was playing on the edge there hey it looked pretty good and then of course Trayvon Diggs so the future in my opinion for the future Kevin Joseph on one side Trayvon Diggs on the other and Anthony Brown he's been so solid this year Cowboy Nation and we got to give that credit and kudos to the coaching staff and their philosophy. It could be just that the coaching style is what Anthony Brown needed, right? And he's been playing so good at that spot and solid that we have not got a chance to see Kelvin Joseph. Kelvin Joseph is still the unknown in that role because we don't know what he would look like. <laughs> for uh, multiple games so uh let's figure this out cowboy nation that's my thoughts of everything i really appreciate you for watching and that's been my time i really thank you all for yours and remember you're listening to nothing but the best go cowboys <laughs>